So, here we have Est ist Volbracht. It is by Bach. Excellent. And it is in B minor. It is an obbligato aria in ritornello form. Um, it begins molt adagio, which is obviously slow, to embrace the sad nature of Jesus being <laughs> crucified by the Jews, probably, or Romans, never mind. It's in de capo structure, which is like ternary form, ABA, but remember, de capo. So we have very sparse texture here. Um, I think that's very important. And the viola echoes the musical gesture. Isn't that beautiful? There we go, that's where the viola does its stuff. Notice how it's very syllabic writing at the moment. There's a high note. That is a D, a D high note. There we go. It's very chromatic, lots of accidental sharps, the occasional flat. There's an A flat there. I'll let you listen to it a bit. It would be fair to say that this is a disjunct melody. The melody shows distress. And the rhythm, listen to it. It's great. Very soon we have modulation. Listen out for that. It's to its relative major. Which is D major. Here we go. D major. Isn't it glorious? And the ritonello returns. Listen to that ritonello. Did I mention that it's the relative major? Intervals! That's another fun part. So, what intervals have we got? Well, a while ago I missed it because I was busy being a... Oh god, she's singing again. Um... Well, there was a beat... Oh god, it's... I can't read out, O'Clef. Forget this, people. So, it gets more conjunct as it goes onwards. So this is good, but what's happened now? Is Jesus dead yet? I don't know. Google it. That's what Wikipedia's for. Listen to the words. And I think it's interesting to notice she is singing in a foreign language. That language is... German. It is, it's German. Also... Did I mention that this is the uh, movement 58 of St. John's Passion by Bach, remember that? Oratorio, I've been told to tell you. There we have the... It's the last words from the cross. Jesus was very cross indeed. Are we on to the B section yet? I think we are. Here comes the B section. Da -da 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 -da. We have death into victory. It's a complete contrast. That's what that symbolizes. This is vivace, which means fast and lively. It's in three, four. Good fun, is it? Yes, yeah, it's like a dance. It's all jolly and yeah, he's dead. Jesus is dead. Hurrah! Texture it, it has been thickened by the contra strings. Not only knows what that means. Melisma! We have Melisma. She's going, <laughs> which is good fun. And then we have an abrupt end. Coming up, here comes Adagio. It symbolizes Jesus' death. D Jesus is dying. Oh God. The Jews are nailing the nails in him. Ah, with C sharp minor, I think. Important to note the use of the diminished seventh chord in the abrupt ending. I'd also mention the diminished seventh chord in the abrupt ending is a very important point. G sharp to G? <laughs> yeah. And that is that. Thank you for listening. Important to note the last words, it is finished. The tragedy has uh, now come home and um, it overwhelms 
the singer. And he's dead. 